it has many secrets. Uh, the first secret is how do I start the game? I can't do anything right now. There we go. That was it. Bimple figured it out. Oh my god, that FOV. Use E to interact with objects. Try speaking to the locals. Police officer. Conf confiscating mushrooms from nearby citizens. Report any truffles to the local authorities. The officer suddenly snaps out of his daze and looks at you. You're looking for your brother? Uh, yeah, I don't know anything about that, sorry. What are you star staring at me for? It's not my job to find missing people. What, you thought because my full name is police officer that I have to help you? Deep within the woods I sleep upon my rotten wooden heap. Though nasty, gross, and slimy seem I, tickle my flaps and my spores will fly. Oh, a newcomer to our humble little town. Wonderful. My name is Wizardo, the average. I'm the town wizard. Oh, you want me to cast a spell? Well, uh, I'm not that kind of wizard. It's more of an honorary title. Anyway, you're looking for your brother, right? Yes, I saw it all with my scrying orb. And no, I don't know where he is. My orb is broken. Yes, orbs can break. Honk honk. Boo Boo the Fool here to report that this is the official Nowhere Clown Corner. What was once an ordinary patch of grass is now the imminent domain of me, Boo Boo the Clown. Contemplating the fungus, please report any truffles to your local authorities. I'm assuming we get some kind of wall jump. Oh, hello again. Good to see you. Uh, James, was it? Well, I seem to be in quite the pickle. My wife, Esmeralda. The great hasn't been particularly thrilled with one of my hobbies, which happens to be candy collection. And, uh, well, let's just say I had a certain bar of chocolate called the Shilarp Crunch, and, uh, she threw it out. Oh god, I wish I had my delicious chocolate bar. Uh, uh, down below is my infamous, infamous monkey pit. I keep all of my bastard monkeys down there. Ook, ook, ook. I am afraid of heights. Get me down, please. Ah. Oh, here's the monkey pits. Eek, eek. I love leaf. So much fun with the leaf. Do not belong here. This is the monkey pit. This vending machine is quietly humming all by itself. It doesn't appear to be plugged in, but it works nonetheless. Looks like they have just one bar of a Schlarp Crunch registered trademark in this entire machine. Tried to buy it, but ran out of money. Just 25 cents short of the total bill. I wish I had a quarter. What a shame. This guy looks like he needs to go to the bathroom all the time. Local big juicy ass. <laughs> I sat on a bumblebee and now I have the most sumptuous ass in the entire town. All men envy me and all women want to be me. Um, this game feels very much a vibe. Disembodied philosopher, welcome to the slumber district. I'm at my wick's end standing here all the time. You should have seen how dark this place was before I got the job. Let's keep the banter light. I gotta stay on guard. Sometimes in the heat of the moment, I imagine myself as an even bigger flame. This is a flesh pit. If ever I saw one. Ki 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 whoop. Love it. Welcome to my home. I.e. I love meat. We are in the meat pit, aren't we? Oh! Oh! This is uh, one of the video games that ever was. Oh, hello, sad square. Do 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 do. Bing. Do 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 do. Bling. Do 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 do. Bing. Bing. Do 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 do. Do 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 The birthplace of all hell divers. You suddenly recall various facts about this species. Despite their ominous appearance, hell divers are a timid species that spend much of their time quietly collecting rare resources underwater. Their most colonial bodies are well suited to intense pressure. Survive as deep as the gulf depths where they reach natural limit. You've run out of memories on hell divers. Maybe you can learn more if you talk to a couple. They don't bite. Trust me. Wow. I love this. Did you know that tomatoes are, carn are carnivorous? If I was going to make a game, I would want to make a game like this. We have acquired gun. Wait, can you bring me with you? I can't move on my own. Yeah, well, I... What the hell? Nice. A game where your gun talks to you? Was this game made by Justin Roiland? 
Sorry, I think I'm in the wrong place. Look, it's an easy mistake to make, all right? Oh, hello. I'm just passing through trying to find my friend, Peeb, and all of that jazz. Have you seen him? You can kill any NPC now, by the way. Oh my god. What is the point of that? Dark Ham has invaded your inventory. Mr. Sprout. Hello, it's me, Mr. Sprout. I'm in kind of a pickle. I wish to be planted. I yell for the earth and cry for my brothers. Wait, can I go in here? This looks like that guy. Is there a way to find, uh, Peebus? The boner lad? You monster. I killed the monkey, I know. Should I kill the mushroom lad? Mr. Sprout, Temple of Uncle. We've done it. Temple of Uncle. Go oh, give Orbo ham. I almost know what you mean. <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? The prince's dream of guy. Why, I'm the prince's dream of guy. The prince's dream of guy. When dreaming, prince dreams easily. He dreams until he dreams of me. But when sleeping saint sleeps fitfully, a nightmare comes for all to see. Do not wake his prince's princely eyes. This will kill saint's dream of a guy. What happens if I kill this lad? Oh, I love vending machines. Give Orbo ham. I've never heard anything more cryptic than give Orbo ham. How do I give him ham? Atheist clown, I don't believe in an afterlife, chief. It doesn't interest me at all. Do you like mysteries? I'm trying to figure out why my head won't stop growing. Uh, young one, I do not know if I can continue. I believe this is my final resting spot. This world, this world is coming apart. Daddy was too strong for us. Please figure out how to stop it before, before it's too late. <laughs> he descends into a horrible coughing fit before going limp. You can tell that he's quietly keeping one eye cracked open to monitor your reaction. <gasps> Quarter! Yay! I know it's a hot take, but war is bad. There's no way. Is that the dark ham? May I have it? Orbo grips the succulent meat with his hands and rips into it. Rivulets of oil weep down his chin. Uh, he's in heaven. You're my hero. Here's a commemorative statuette as thanks. I'm not sure it's going to do much for you, but it's all I got right now. Nice old snacky snack. Good old snack yummy yums. Mm-mm, delicious, you know? We've got a quarter of time to crack this puppy open. All right, it's time to finally get myself a bar of Schlarp Crunch. Wait, is that a bar of Schlarp Crunch you have there? Oh. I... could... could I have it? Please. You are unleashed, uh, suddenly struck with a sense of empathy you've never experienced before. How could you not give it to him? You quietly slip the bar into his trembling hands with a half-hearted smile. You love Schlarp Crunch, but you're compelled to do the right thing. The wizard quivers as he stares at the bar with astonishment. He gingerly peels the wrapper back and gazes at the exposed chocolate lovingly. He carefully lifts the bar up and wraps his mouth around the sweet goodness. He begins taking small bites like a squirrel with a nut. His eyes water. You don't know how long he's been without Schlarp Crunch, but you can tell it's suturing a deep wound in his heart. He's completely focused on the bar now, like an Olympian sprinter riding the track. He's in ecstasy. Finally, after a mere couple nibbles, he turns his attention back to you, his wizened eyes watering. I... I'm at a loss of words. You are so kind, so utterly gracious. I don't know what I can do for you, but thank you. He quietly returns to the bar, sniffling as he takes the tiniest bites possible, trying to savor each and every morsel for as long as he can. That voice reminds me of the cursed SpongeBob satire episode. Oh, you know what I was thinking? Uh, this voice was here to check this out. Hold on. Why SpongeBob? Why? 